Hey, this is Mike with Lee Power Steering, and we're doing a quick little video here to show you how to check whether or not your poppet is stuck. Um, so this is basically what you got to do. Take a little T-handle Allen wrench. This is basically like an eighth inch T-handle. Um, once your pressure line is off, you can put that T-handle into the port, and it'll go through the little flow control hole. And you should be able to get back in there to the piston, and there's a spring behind it. And it's got about a half inch of travel and it should go in and spring back out like you see right there if you go in with this t-handle and it's just hard and at the back of its travel then that's telling you that the piston is stuck um, which happens super easy with just the smallest bit of contamination so at that point you can pull out the flow control and you get access to the piston and the spring. And at this point, just be very careful to note the orientation of everything so that you can put it back in the same way. And we just lost the spring, which is exactly what can happen to you. So there's the spring and that's how it should look. And that spring will pop out at you. So be careful not to shoot it across the shop. Um, so what I'm talking about getting stuck is this piston can get stuck in the bore in there and it gets stuck in bypass and the pump won't create pressure. So at that point you can take this apart and you can inspect the piston and you can see this one is nice and clean. The oil looks clean. There's no scrapes or gouges. If they get stuck in there, they'll kind of scar up here a little bit and you can polish them and put them back in. Um, but basically that's what we're looking to see is if this was stuck and if it was stuck, was it contamination that caused it? And that's usually what we see and just a little bit of contamination in there can get this thing stuck. So um, hopefully this video helps you out. Thank you.